Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back here to my channel where I play Plan Zoo. My name is Nisa and today we're gonna take a look at the American Black Bear, which is a mod made by Jasper Emissions, I think it's pronounced, and Leaf. And um, yeah, we know Leaf, but Jasper and Emissions I haven't heard about and I don't think I have seen anything about. So um, let's yeah let's see it if uh, what they deliver. Uh, as you can see here on the picture below, it is called American Black Bear, but it isn't completely black. I did see some pictures where they appear completely black, but most of the pictures, like this one, they have this brown hue to it, um, which appear mostly black especially in uh, shadows and something like that but in the sun you can see this brownish hue to it it is very much like the motion black bear with this uh, lighter part around the nose area and they have these small not completely rounded bear ears they are longer than they are wide so they are more like sticking up ears but it is a very heavy fellow. Uh, most of the pictures I saw with them standing up, the stomach were uh, standing up on four legs. The stomach were more than halfway down the to the ground. So they seem very heavy and very fluffy. So will we run into the fluffiness issue today? I'm gonna get right into the game here. And as you can see, they do both swim and they do dive for their food i put in this piece here they don't climb too much but i have seen them use them a few times i would like to just for the comparison's sake we have a full motion black bear male i'm gonna place him here and then a male american black bear here i didn't choose to compared to all the bears because i think it's the full motion one you will see the biggest difference with or the smallest difference with and as you can see they have both been swimming but the full motion black bear here is clearly bigger a lot bigger to be honest but besides that they have the same lighter part here uh, and the bear like ears here and here and the same claws so all oh, they look a lot alike but these are clearly smaller so we're gonna start the time and not that button <laughs> that button here you can see here on picture you can actually see some of that brownish shoe to it i will like to see when when they dry up hopefully we will find a dry one or uh, when we go to the close-ups uh, but they are vulnerable and they are between 600,000 to 900,000 left uh, in the wild at this point. And jumping out here, they are from North America, more specifically Canada, Mexico and USA. They live in timber, taiga, grassland, tundra and desert biomes. So everything but tropical. And one of them needs 300 square meters of land and 20 of climbable areas. Again, if you give them water, they will swim. Uh, minus 10 to 42 degrees Celsius. And you need a, a grade 4 climb proof fence. 6.6 uh, .6 feet tall. That's just about 2 meters. Um, let's see here. It's like the other bears, one male, one female, or one of each. No dominants, they are promiscuous, they are shy, and guess should not enter the habitat. Both males and females grow to 5.25 feet long, so that's about a meter and a meter and a half, maybe, maybe a little bit more. Uh, the males live for around 20 years and the females 22 males weigh around 400 pounds that's around 200 kilo and the females 135 pounds so that's around 
60, 67.5 kilo, I think. Um, they reach sexual maturity at age five and they can reproduce until they die. They will give between one and three offspring every second year and they are pregnant for seven months. And they should be quite easy to get to reproduce in captivity. They don't have any interspecies enrichment, which makes a lot of sense. And I did try to click down here on for motion black bear. The food enrichment is the same, but uh, they don't have the balls, the big balls here, but otherwise uh, the same. So we have the two rubbing threes and the rubbing pillar. We have the blood in the sack, the wine chimes. We have the um, submarine, which tells us that it's been updated fairly newly. Then we have both catbot boxes and the herbs in market, the fire hose ball, chew toy thingy, and both of these bobbins, drums. Uh, over here we have the food enrichment and we have this tr tree scatter feeder, we have the uh, large fixed roller feeder, we have the tree forage there, we have the bamboo feeder here and we have the blood of frozen uh, fruit, I think it is. Yeah, I don't know why they don't have the blood of frozen fish because the food was still... They eat fish because they eat from these and they use both of them. Uh, oh, that's the baby. Um, seems like they are swimming now. That's the Formotion Black Bear. It also seems like the Formotion Black Bear has this grayish hue to it compared to the rest. But what about you? Here we have Tamara, which is a pregnant female. So let's take a look at her. Her. oh she's been fighting but yeah i don't feel like the ears does what i want them to if we do like this um uh, Sandra. Uh, you can see here the ears here are very mickey mouse like obviously smaller but they are pretty much half rounded where on the picture beneath me, they look uh, more narrow down here and then longer. They did get the canines in here. You can't see it on this picture, but uh, I did see some pictures of the canines. Um, the eyes also seems they are very dark. They don't have that much. They have the shine to it, but it's hard to get a really good look at them. Yeah, I can see here. They initially just looked black, but they do have the brown around the irises and then the white, little, little white thing there. We have a tiny bit of glitching going on. Keep in mind that might be my computer and the uh, beautiful claws. The fluff is, uh, I think it's a summer coat because it clearly seems longer on the picture. Um, but a lot of bears change the, the length of their coat through the years, so it wouldn't be weird that uh, these also do, and also the fact that they live in Canada and Mexico, so it is possible that Mexican-American black bears have shorter hairs than the Canadian, Canadian ones. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, just a little notice but they do seems to work fairly fine as i said they do climb but not unless they have to so i have been seen them use this a lot to get up to these and i have seen them climb up here and take a nap uh, and also over here but i haven't seen them climb a lot around let's see the baby where's the baby we have a little male called Rollo, and he's here. <laughs> uh, 
This note lip makes a binty thing there. Is it because it eats or does it, it actually do that? Oh no. I saw something. Hopefully it was just because of the animation, but I'm gonna check here. Oh, I can't get further down. I'm pretty sure I so, saw so something. I gonna I gonna Im investigate this. So I'm gonna move you up here to investigate. I can't place you there. Why can't I? Oh, I feel like I saw th th through not the mouth but beneath the lip and the snout. There was something in between where you could see. It. Um, through. Hmm. Well, it's fairly clever if you only can see it if you have that specific angle in that specific moment. Yeah, I can't find it. But overall, it. It works very well, this cup. It's very cute and it's very baby-like. It's one of those animals where you... If you see the baby just on its own, you can still see it's a baby. You would never be confused about that. Here. It looks kind of thin haired up here but I think it's because it have some lighter strands of hair uh, when I do this you can if when you look here at the forehead you can see it move around but besides that it looks good the snout looks a little bit too big for the face which is very baby like uh, with cups uh, their eyes looks kind of droopy, which makes it look very old on the other hand. So that's kind of a, a funny thing where the snout and the ears looks baby-like, but the eyes looks very old. But yeah, overall, we wrong button. Overall, I will see. <laughs> Gonna try again. Lucky number three there. Yeah. Overall, I will say, again, we have a very good mud on our hand. They do swim fairly well. I haven't seen the cup swim. Uh, maybe he do that at a point. But all of the adults swim as they should in the right level. Um, and they, as you saw in the beginning, they look beautiful when they dive. So, uh, yeah. I will leave it up to you if you want to download it. As always, I have a video link below by Leaf who explains how to download mods and install them into your games if you haven't tried it before or if you just haven't tried it with Planner Zoo before because there's a specific way of doing it without crashing your game. Um, and then there's a link to where you can go and download this mod on Nexus. I get asked this question a lot. I always use them. All of the links below all of the links uh, if you want to see them there so yeah uh, yeah have a, have a good day and you know the drill guys like subscribe and turn on the bell notifications so you know the next time I upload a video I really hope to see you again at the end it comes below or in the next video bye guys <laughs>